Hi Libra, welcome to my channel, we're doing your reading. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Relax, sit down, and enjoy the ride. <laughs> okay, so first of all, we're going to be using the Ankh deck, which is our own okay, trilogy mystery deck. This is this comes in three, it is in our second one now, so do check it out. Um, that's the one and only, only at Eat, Read, Love. Okay, so we publish our own deck. Um, so this is, uh, this is what we're going to be used for the Tarot. I'll be reading your chart at the same time, Libra, based on sidereal, Jotish, of course, astrology, to shed light. Okay, this is what we're going to do. So that one, we use your ascendant, but with the Tarot, you can use whatever you want, you know, with Libra. The first is the card of resonance. The rest has to be the future, so you shouldn't even resonate with it. Because I'm a seer of the future, not the past. Everybody's reading the past. I need a new job. Let me read the future. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so here we go. Let's begin. Alrighty. Okay, Libra in the past. No, it's not in the past. It's in your current. This is your card of resonance. Nine of cups. Happy, single, you know, like no responsibility. That's the nine of cups. Getting a lot of attention, wishes being granted. Um, this is uh, a card of you are gonna get bored. I'm letting you know, because uh, you're sitting there. At some point, it's gonna it will want to share love, family, home with someone. So you were. I feel like you are an overachiever as as a young person. You have that whole life ahead of you. You were, um, you know, um, what do you call that? A dean's lister. You were a creme de la creme, you know. But now it's more of like, if you're young, have you gone viral? You know, <laughs> this is what this is what the young ones wants now. Okay, <laughs> so with the Nine of Cups, you were viral because the way that you have, um, I feel like exec is it execute or finish your school or studies, you always excel mm -hmm, with the Nine of Cups. Now the way I see, oh, it is ascendant in Libra right now. I just refresh my screen. You know, this is what's rising in the east at eight degrees. This is your happy birthday, even though it's not your birthday. Oh, I, I love it. So it matches. I like that I'm doing the Libra reading during the ascendant in Libra. Okay, which only means that we are in a portal. I mean, this is how I'm seeing it right now. They're giving us. They're gonna give us a lot of message. There's an opening, a window. Um, Money-wise, let's try to save, of course. I've told you that already. Um, there may be some uh, family emergency that you will need to help. It's either family or a, a person that is close to you, a near and dear, okay? Because that's what I'm seeing it here. You're very much uh, also have, um, let's just say you have bills or debts. You have settled those also. Um, any kind of recurring payment, you have canceled that as well. Mm. Even recurring payment I see in the cards. I swear. <laughs> I don't know. You have Netflix, HBO, you know, all those things. Those are recurring. Um, with the Five of Swords, um, now, tension is rising, of course. The only way I see tension is the people that you network or you associate with. So chances are this is in the work environment. Family life, you got it good. Now, the people in your environment, in the work area, that's where the tension is. Mars and Sun over there, okay? So, those are two malefic planets. They're just bumping and bumping and grinding, okay, in that 11th house of yours, which is also your finances. So, you have, you have expenses that is off the roof, Libra. You know what you need? Driftwood. Put it in your wallet, okay? Because it's going to be, it's going to break your wallet. You cannot carry it anymore. <laughs> No, not a driftwood. I forgot what it's called, but it's a, it's, um, I forgot. It's just, uh, it's a color black wood that you, it's supposed to prevent you from spending. I forgot what it's called. Uh, I f I'll remember it. <laughs> Knight of Wands over here um, with the Five of Swords. Now, someone is uh, very much flirtatious about you. Jet, there you go. Jet is called. So if you want to control your finances, which I do advise, especially right now, um, or maybe too late, is uh, to buy a jet, not a plane. Okay, it's a it's a wood. Okay, and it's like color black. You put it in your purse or your bag. Okay, it, it trust me on that one. Okay, um, Knight of Wands again. Uh, let's come back to this. Um, Knight of Wands. It feels like 
you have someone very fun loving um you've met this probably per this person probably like a year or two years ago or one is even just there's someone's coming towards you if you haven't met anyone um it's it feels like you know like it's not going anywhere and that's one thing that will frustrate you as the moon is in gemini right now in zero degrees um for the libra um it looks like you have this uh, you have a tendency to um shed so, so much hope on give uh, give people too much hope or chance second chances there you go um you're that's way that's why this person can sway you like back and forth back and forth because that's how that's what a knight does you're upset with it because you already seen it okay and that's why you want to cut them off mm -hmm. yes i see it here you will and if you don't do it right now, after September 6th, you will do it anyway. <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, 50-50 chance. See? The hangman. Because you, you're done compromising. Mm -hmm. um, seeing here also where you're triggered. Okay? You're triggered by their actions. It's always selfish. It's like a child. Yeah. Why, do you Why do you date a child always? I don't know with you. Okay. Like something probably is in your chart that uh, triggers for you to to get into someone who's in the in the younger arena. Okay, let me see. You have the three of cups right there. See, good, good, very, very good. You know, in the card of resonance there. That only means that you were really um, dating around, talking to people, and having a good time with friends and family. And this person is annoyed easily. Five swords with the Queen of Wands. Um, they are, I don't know why they're very salty with you when you're just doing you. I, I really don't understand that. This is a, a natural born hater. Yeah, there are people like that. They don't, <laughs> I just laugh at it. Because they're born like that, you know. Like maybe she's Maybelline. So for this person, maybe they're a hater. <laughs> so they just hate you, whoever you dated. Four of Swords, you shut down on them. Page of Wands and the Knight of Cups. Um, you find this person useless in life. Yeah, mm -hmm. I see it here. Like they can't even make up for the things that they have wronged you. And the only thing that they can keep doing is to say sorry for the mistakes. And I feel like it's repetitive. I don't like what is going on with your life life. <laughs> Just letting you know. It's really like, what is going on here? Like seriously, Libra. You know, it's just like, oh, I know. Your Lagna Lord is going to go finally in its debilitation, which makes the relationship a little bit challenging. But second week of October, something to look forward. So if uh, in your end right now, um, sink or swim, well, Libra, we need to learn to float. Okay, <laughs> Let's learn to float all the way to sec second, uh, second week of October. It will be much better. However... When the sun goes to Libra, which is right now it's still in Leo, there's still there's like two to three more months, uh, two months, two months, sorry, two months, two and a half actually. Um, when the sun goes to Libra, but it is you know the sun does not like the Libra, you know the you know it's debilitated there in specific uh, degree. Um, it will be a challenge again. So there's a small window, Libra. I know you you got the other reading like it's lucky to be a Libra. But of course, the planet always moves, and I'm seeing it right now. You got to play it safe first, okay? Because I know when I predicted for you, the prediction was moving forward for a, a longer period of time. But this one is very current. You will get frustrated. You will get annoyed. You will get bombarded by this person's neediness, immaturity, and you don't know what to do anymore with the hangman and the moon. Like, how do I treat this? Well, I'll continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below. And I, I'm not a doctor, but an Advil helps. I mean, that's what helps me. Because okay. <laughs> this is like a headache. Okay. So that's what I would take. All right. So <laughs> yeah, so I'm not a doctor. But for a headache, that's what I take for myself. Oh, I, I just can't. I feel like your energy is very stagnant here. You will feel, again, the word is suffocated and you will just rip this person to shreds. That's what I can see. Link down there, follow me, and I'll see you guys again. Bye.